What is so striking about these images by children from World War II in Poland during the German occupation to 2022 and Ukraine under Russian assault is their similarity. This is a much more universal language, so they can communicate and feel like somebody might hear, somebody might listen, but they're also talking to themselves. The exhibit Mom, I Don't Want War conveys the horror of armed conflict, something the top diplomatic representatives of Ukraine and Poland in Chicago connected on today at Northeastern Illinois University. And before the panel discussion, those representatives underlined war's unpredictability, including what to make of yesterday's missile bombing in Poland that killed two people. Our services are on the spot. Uh, they are um, analyzed what happened. The Secretary General of NATO said that a Ukrainian air defense missile most likely caused the explosion Tuesday, a situation that improperly handled could have widened this conflict to an all-out Russia-NATO brawl. Our Western partners work very hard on this uh, uh, um, event and we are waiting for result of uh, investigation. Joined by the Consul General for the Czech Republic, the diplomats praised solidarity in the fight against aggression and reflected on a timeless story as illustrated by children from the last century, images preserved in Polish archives to the present day where kids can post their art to the mom I see war portal. Put it on paper and not hold it in inside of themselves. So it's a kind of a rippling effect. The images in this exhibition are organized according to themes. This one is hope in Ukraine. And you can see the bright colors trying to give young children some idea that better days are ahead. Images like these are available online. They're going to be auctioned, and the money that comes from those auctions is going to help those kids in Ukraine. This exhibition will be here until Friday at NEIU. Ravi Bechwal, ABC7 Eyewitness News.